Coffee's got it. I just need some light down here, so when I come down Afternoon. Here... Hey! Hello, Diego. How was the play? It was hilarious. It was actually kind of fun. <laughs> That's good. So you're what saying you down see? here, Buggy? Yeah, just like somewhere by... The... No, not... That is like the worst spot you could put it. Hi, where's our food? Go coffee. <laughs> My favorite here by the stairs, like right here. Okay. I, I queued up a stone brazier. I'm surprised that you don't... In have uh light down here. Well, I think that's what Buggy was working on. Where's the food? Yeah. Yeah. Well, no, what I'm saying is I extra. without the torch or anything, just I can see Just click on any just chest, fire. it'll be... it'll yeah, come up. Yeah. It's right next to the campfire. Not that one, the other one. This one over here. So do our bodies stay in here when we log off like an arc? No, they don't. Okay. That sounded weird, but I didn't know how else to ask that. <laughs> wow, that light goes... <laughs> Five blocks, and it's like, no no more light from there. Interesting. Wait, what do we Lighting have currently model? specialized? Um, well, I've got 42,000 skill points, so... Oh, pretty never much mind. All, Whatever you pretty want. much all specialized in everything. Yeah, we uh, after you left, we tweaked the settings and put it. We we changed a value from zero to one, not realizing that a more appropriate value might have been point zero 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 one. <laughs> but hey, you live and you learn. Yeah, we've had fun ever since. One hundred and seventeen thousand skill points I've got, and I've researched everything oh, wow. I can research. No, I've only got like a hundred and seventy to spend. <laughs> Yeah, go and oh. cut down a tree or mine some rocks. You'll get a lot really fast. Start doing <laughs> something and you'll be good. Yep. Got 146,000. <laughs> oh, and 1,000. Oh, we Wait, have lumber. Maybe I shouldn't have, should have said that out loud. It means I've been doing the least. <laughs> what was that? Oz, could you come We're used to that, though. Raw meat project at the butchery table. Ah, oh, yes, sorry, forgot about that. Yeah, it, since there's no more wolves or anything, it it's not, it's there. And then, uh, Anominate has raw meat to collect. Ooh, ooh, I just well, saw we can make beds. Mm -hmm. I don't know what it's for, though. Sleeping. Well, yeah. Well, yeah <laughs> gonna, but you don't sleep in this game. <laughs> You really don't sleep in the game, so that's why it's weird. Well, maybe it allows you to sleep to skip to morning. No. I wouldn't want to do that with such a time constraint. Yeah. Just <laughs> sleep every night away and it's like, oh, our meteor's on its way. Probably impacts the house value then. Yeah. Okay. Because that's a thing. Do they no, actually want to like create like economies with this game? Like, oh, well, I have you can a house totally for make sale. a store. You can totally make a store to set, to trade stuff. Oh, I know. Yeah, if you have a if you have the very large multiplayer going and stuff. I made oh. some sausage. If anyone wants it. <laughs> Anybody yeah. want some? some Anybody want sausage? coffee sausage? <laughs> <laughs> yep. I was in. just gonna leave that one right there. Ooh, campfire stew. Okay, any, have any more books finished? No. In the last uh, 20 minutes? The latest one I've been working on is still going, I think. Oh, lumber. I don't think I have that one. Oh, did that finish finally? Yeah, it did. Yay. Good. So that should allow us to make a sawmill, right? Mm-hmm. So if lumber finished, then cooking is going. After that, we're going to have cementing. And then I'm going to make... Um... Where to go? Uh, bakery. Or baking. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, 52,000 right. skill points. I don't know what we need to make the sawmill. Smith. Lumber. Okay, so yeah, it's a crafting station that makes lumber. It gives you wood pulp as a byproduct. 
so that will actually be very very helpful mm -hmm. oh okay it's made in the anvil which requires which you make up in the forge smeltery thing okay yep. there we go now i've got the levels so i am going to five an iron anvil ingots thing. oh wow somebody's down here oh is it full Yeah, campfire stew. <clears throat> what is it? Oh, it's waiting on iron ore. We don't have any iron ore up here yet. You guys don't? You should have tons of iron ore over there. Oh, right. You gotta do that whole toggle the duvalaki. Yeah. <laughs> oh, what was that? I believe he said duvalaki. Yep. Wow. I heard toggle Ooh, something. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's a buck or an elk right over there, and we could e use a chest over here too, so we could put the ingots into. There's a turkey too. Chest I can make really quick. Awesome. And yeah, just go put it like right next to the smell tree. <clears throat> Should I join Austin just doing hunting? Uh, oh, we have plenty of meat right now. Yeah. We uh we have high level butchery, so like one elk gives you ludicrous amounts of meat. All right. Ludicrous. One elk gives you like five elk worth of meat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, especially after all the upgrades. Oh. I think I'm gonna have to quit the game for a little bit to let my computer cool down. I'm really jumpy. Hmm. There we go. Okay, Buggy, I just grabbed that chest that you made. Okay. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Go ahead and place that over here. <clears throat> Alright, cool. Anomaly, did you make your anvil? I queued it up. I'm gonna go back okay. up there and check on it in a second. Okay, cool. Um... Okay, oh, so... that's weird. Oh, what apparently I... I just got some raw bacon. Nice. Oh, you can grind stone to sand. Yeah. That's and each well, we might need another one of these masonry tables. Uh, there are two. Okay. So, Nominate, if you come over here uh -huh. and just uh, link that to it, then it should take oh. care of everything automatically. Sand project. Uh, oh boy, just... two o'clock. Okay. Uh, what do I need to link to it? The crate to the uh, bloomery. I don't know why it's called a bloomery. <laughs> um. Sand. Why is it not seeing sand? I see stockpiles, but I don't see the that storage yet. It should be right there. I already have oh, it linked down there. Is right, right at the end. Sand. Okay, but oh, right, because the ingots are in my inventory. Mm -hmm. There we yeah, go. So you... Woohoo! Look at that. Nice. Stationary pitch. Queue up a few of that. Yeah, I queued oh, up wow. a lot of it. I queue up a lot of it. I mean, 20 only uses four sand. There we go. Okay, so that's a start for that. And then, what's the other thing we need? Many things. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Well, the biggest thing I need is for this oh, research no, to be able to hurry up. We got plenty of mortar. So, Six off. minutes left on the cooking skill book. Oh, I can take and it. thirty on that. Uh, 90. Yeah. If somebody wants to go find coal, we can go ahead and uh, do advanced smelting book. We do have a bit of coal. Yep. We <clears> found <throat> a vein earlier, so there's a bit of it up here. Okay. Depends on how much you need, though. Four. 
Yeah, there's more than that up there. There's like, I think I found like a four block vein or something like that. Okay, and then we'll also need the, uh, we'll need 20 more iron ingots. All right, well, we're still trying to enclose this uh, smeltery in so far. Yeah, so that I hasn't happened. Waiting on that for now. Really? Somebody clear this up. There's some more coal back here. Although you'd think if your world was about to be wiped out by an asteroid, you wouldn't be so worried about polluting. Yeah, but what happens if you pollute your world to the point it's uninhabitable, and then you save yourself from the asteroid, and then you die because you well, killed your planet? That takes then, eons, then your, your space is, uh, yeah, your, your uh, space technology is enough to go and find another planet at that point. Or your technology is so high that you can re-terraform the planet you're on. To be a little That's bit true. But I, the game devs made this game to be a very big multiplayer game, so you with everyone to make sure you don't pollute it. Which makes things difficult. Oh, there's a brick over here. Sweet. Oh, I think I just blocked you in. No. Yep. <laughs> oh no, that's not supposed to be on the other side. How do you use carts? Uh, press E on the handle bit of it. There we go. Figured this is gonna be a lot easier for mining. Uh, except you can't take it upstairs, it has to be a very gradual ramp. Mm -hmm. Which we don't have set up yet. So if you want to make a very gradual ramp, that's fine, but yeah. Oh, Sounds good. Lots of coal. Plenty of coal. <clears throat> Alright, we're out again. Coffee's in a timeout, it looks like. Hmm. I'm mostly waiting on that uh, skill book to be done. Because I can't progress with anything else. Ooh, we're getting fancy out here. Oh, Alright, yeah. now I need a lot more stone again. Mm -hmm. Doesn't this thing need to be enclosed too? Which thing is that? The forge thing? Nope. Nope, it does not need to be in a building. In fact, I'm pretty sure it could be completely outside, but um, yeah. all it needs is power. So why really does this... Why does a slag need to be in a building? Because it creates pr uh, pollution. So if you were to go to your mini map there and uh, turn, yeah, that. yeah the uh, ground pollution spread, you'll see it's starting to pull over here, which is meaning that it's starting to pollute just a little bit. So it just passively produces pollution. Mm -hmm. it. Yeah. So do we wanna, if we're gonna, do we want to eventually have a second story to this thing? And... Probably, yeah, we will. Um, the other um, thing that, it... unless we can get the other smelter, which doesn't pollute in the same way, that creates air. No. Oh. Yeah. Oh. But it creates a lot less slag, and it's way more efficient. Ground pollution is worse than the air pollution. Yeah. Because you know, air pollution. That's fine. <laughs> yeah. Ground pollution sleeps, seeps into your water and your crops and the dirt and everything. While the air pollution just, you know, kills the birds. There's a ton and... of mortared stone in here. I'm gonna grab some. Oh, oh, I... oh we need it. We need a ton of it. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna grab it and help build. Yo, I just queued up some more mortared stone, but we still need a lot more. I'm gonna go mining. Yep, oh, sorry there. Why can't I place things and stuff? Do you need a special tool? No, you, uh, you just use the hammer. Not the hammer. It's not giving me any indication. Oh, there we go. Oh yeah, the, when you're standing next to those stockpiles, most of the time it wants to try and put items into the stockpile. Oh. So you've got to be standing on the wall and things like that. It's, it's kind of annoying. 
Okay, so we are, what, two and two? No. Yeah, two and two, it looks like. So, that's actually one, two, there, and then pick this one up. Oh, come on, cooking. Hurry up. Oh, look at that. 30 seconds. Two. Oh, this other smelter, what do we need to get that going? The advanced smeltery, or mm -hmm. advanced, uh, we need 20 more iron, and I need, uh, 24 more coal to make the book. <clears throat> How tall do we need to make this beast? I um, have no idea. The ceiling can go on top of, I'll mark it out. The cooking book is done, by the way. Oh, honey book. Mm hmm Which means I can make probably a kitchen soon. Ew. Might need another room for that. Uh... Yeah. Because for some reason the game actually cares, like, what rooms are set up as well. What are you guys needing so much dirt for? <laughs> oh, I need to make a cast iron stove, which is made at the anvil. Where's the anvil that you made? Uh, probably still in the machine, because I haven't been back there. Got I'm it. making one more dead stone. Fair enough. So actually, it's probably gone straight into that chest. So that is going to be... All right, let's see what this anvil needs. Um, so you said you needed 20 more iron ingots? Mm-hmm. Yeah, if you guys want the advanced smeltery, or smeltering... It smelting. sounds like we should do it. So I've queued it up. It's going to take a while. And we just ran into another coal vein downstairs, so let me go and work on that. Yeah, I've been mining it. There's some in the stockpile already. I had a bunch in the stockpile. Yeah, it needs like 20 coal to get the next book, though. Oh, boy. Okay. Actually, this looks like There's a decent size. Uh, Sixteen coal in here. So yeah, this is we... a decent size vein, so we should be good. Yep. Yeah, but to be able to use the anvil, we need to build a brick, lumber, and glass house. Oh. Uh. Yep. Yeah. What? Yep. Tier two Why? materials. Why? Well, all you need to do is replace some of the parts of the house with brick. Oh, okay. Well, we have bricks. It needs a certain amount of, uh, I think it's tier 2 material, so brick. Let's see if I can't find the bricks. Wait, where are we putting coal? Uh, up, near the, big... up near the smeltery for now. Oh, there's a big stack of it. Next to the wood. Well, the smelter is the main thing that needs it right now, so that's where I'm trying to put it. But yeah, we have we have more than, like, I've got 20 right now, and there's more coming. Yeah, I guess this works. Can't I move? Oh, because... probably because I just put something right inside of you. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. <laughs> nope. Uh, nope. Just wow. Now. Okay, so I need 
18 of those. You tried to place a piece of coal where I was standing. Mm-hmm. So That's why you don't hurt. stand inside well, the stockpile. I didn't I try to place it there. He did where place it, it there. <laughs> I wasn't standing in the stockpile. <laughs> Why is it telling you there's something there? Block update. We have a lot of coal now. Cool. Coal. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Now we can use the anvil. So the next thing is a blast furnace. And that can make stuff a lot better. It uses brick and steel. But that has to be contained within a room. Yep. Oh boy. What else do we have here? We have the cast iron stove, which is what I need for cooking stuff. However, um, that needs to be contained within a room that has 32 tier 2 materials at least <laughs> which means I'd have to break part of the wall off and replace it with brick oh, and that's, then, that's fine to do yeah. and then there's a cement kiln which produces cement and concrete and we can make copper pipe which transports oh. liquids I don't know how that works but and also iron pipe Mm -hmm. and so what we you're can saying now... is it gets it only gets more complicated from here. Yes, it gets more complicated from here. Um, we can create currency now with a mint, and we can create the sawmill. I need six normal logs and four ingots of iron to. Okay, uh, four iron ingots should be easily and easily done, and we have plenty of wood. Mm -hmm. And then the next metal for unlocking is steel which probably needs to be made inside of the blast furnace. Rebar. Okay, okay, iron ingots are going. Cool. And the sawmill needs... Um, okay, the sawmill can be tier one uh, can materials and it needs to be inside of a building, so I think we have room upstairs for it. And that can make the kitchen. Yes. Kitchen is the other thing I need. And I have like 10 minutes before I have to leave. Oh. And get ready for work. Oh, yay, I can make the baking book though. Bacon book? Baking. Oh. <laughs> the bacon book sounds more interesting. Right. It does. Well, the uh, the uh, stove lets you uh, unlock the crispy bacon recipe. Whoa. <laughs> I'm hungry. <laughs> yeah, I haven't had really lunch today? yet. So now that's making me real hungry because I haven't had lunch. You're welcome. I ate lunch before I came to play. I have a bit here, guys. Okay. And sorry, I got the cart stuck down here. <laughs> Did you take it down into the mine? Yeah, I was trying to build a ramp, and it it went down 
where I couldn't uh, couldn't bring it up further, so I didn't have much have choice. Nominate, you gotta have a nominate take it down then. He's the only one with a deed to do it. No, the, I put the deeds into one of the chests. Oh. I don't have it on me. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he uh, made it public though, so anyone can use it. Yeah, but yeah, you need to break it to down. deconstruct it. Ah. Uh, Twenty-nine days, thirteen hours, and forty-two minutes. Mm-hmm. Man, that is a lot of slag already. Or tailings. We carry ten ten bricks at a time. Yeah, I would say like if there if there was an option to turn that off as like a first playthrough, that seems like something you should do. <laughs> right. Oh wait, you gotta see what it looks like when it happens. Yep. That's why I need that much more. Uh, so oh. the only problem with building it the way you're building it there, uh, is first, those windows are too big to register as windows in the game unless we actually put window blocks in them. I'm just building how Z had it set up. <laughs> Oh boy, I need a new tree. Doesn't. A new family tree? Nope. Just a new actual tree. Fresh uh, trees to be cut down. That stockpile's I... like half full, and we've only done a handful of ingots. Mm -hmm. It's ridiculous. Um, okay, the sawmill is being created. We got two and a half minutes till it's done. And then, after that, I will work on the advanced smelting book once the rest of the iron is created. And we're close to that, I think. Why do we get so many points? This is a ridiculous number of points. <laughs> yeah, we messed up. We, are, we already described that. <laughs> Maybe he wow. just didn't understand how ridiculous. No, I didn't understand how ridiculous. So a heads up, carrying iron is ridiculously heavy. So I'll be on a cart. <laughs> yeah. Oh, but we got that cart stock, remember? I just need someone to grab the bead and break it down and move it. I just need ten more. There well, we go. Like I said, the deed is in one of the chests, so you're welcome to find it and move it. I'm working on it. Give me a minute. Ooh, it's dark. What do you mean it's dark? It's dark. It's dark. It's daytime. It's not. <laughs> it is. It is for me. Half you go to work. <laughs> no, I mean, in the game, it's daytime still. It's daylight. No, it's not. It's it is most not definitely... very much nighttime. There is a very moon. High. I would I love to see your screen, Coffee. Okay. Look Coffee. at Discord. What? No. I might need to relog. He's not seeing yeah. what we're seeing. There we go. Okay, advanced smelting is uh, on the key for research. Um, currently, Wait. we are doing uh, okay. cementing, and then I have baking, and then the smelting is next. I have the deed for the cart, so how do I get rid of the cart? Hammer. Ah. Uh, yeah, use your hammer. All right. It's hammer time. Oh, I have to empty the cart first. Oh, I need to be take that way. That way. Okay. Let's go and save place. Did we 
we say another uh, block was done, or is that? Yeah, uh, well, cooking is done if you haven't already got that one. I think I got that one already. Uh... Oh, chef. Cooking, yeah. I got all that already. Okay, I've got the card out. Alright, well, I'm gonna hop off and start to get ready for work. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Oh, Alrighty. Bobby. Yep. Goodbye. Don't work too hard. Ah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> How do you turn on the torch? You put it in your hand. Or I mean, the standing torch. You have to put torches in it. Uh... Because, you know, torches burn torches. You know, that's how <laughs> the world works. Where is our thing that's making metal? Where do I make torches at? That is the thing that we're enclosing right now, so it doesn't pollute so much. Alright, that's up the hill. You're not kidding. <laughs> you know, it might make logical sense if I uh, build a little stairway. Wait. Wait, where did we put the metal ingots? Is it... What do you need metal ingots for? And the reason I was pulling the card out was so coffee could move metal ingots. <laughs> now I'm... Metal, ing metal ingots are in the chest next to the smelter. Or at least they should be. Um, I don't think uh, metal ingots can be put into the cart. Maybe they can, but I don't know. I think it's anything can be put in a cart. I mean, it's just a, just a volume to put stuff in. I could be mistaken, though. There are some weird things this game does that make no sense. I love how you can only carry 10 blocks at a time. Well, that's mostly just their idea of balance. Hmm. Look at that, a stairway. Who would have thunk it? Yeah, I, I, I thought it might come in handy. Now, is there another? Is there enough space on the other side of this? Or I another set so. of? I believe there was enough room. We will find out. Because yeah, the doorway is centered. Hmm. Is this? This is one, two, three, four, five blocks. One, two, four, five. Six, seven, yes, so there's exactly a two a two gap in the middle. Yes, we can put metal in the cart. Oh. What do we need metal for? What do we need metal for? Uh, we needed it for certain recipes a little while ago. Lots I don't need lots them. Lots and lots and lots of things. I mean, right now, I don't think there's anything pressing. Okay. Right. Then I will go back to mining. Uh, I imagine the next thing we'll need it for is repairing our tools that are slowly starting to break from all of this work. Oh, I hate how you can only carry ten bricks at a time. Yeah. Jesus. It makes... it's, it's making... well... Yes, yeah, it's, it's kind of making it a little bit more tedious than it needs to be. Oh, we should uh, agree on which of the br bricks we're going to use. Because we've got a mixture here. Do? Yeah, all these ones in the middle are the those plain square ones. Well, I, I guess I didn't... What? What's the difference? 
I'm just using the top one. Yeah, the top one has got the little hollow in the middle, whereas the, there's also a plain square one, which oh. was used in some places, and they just they just don't connect to texture. It's a very important thing. Mm. I don't know if we can put two doors on this thing and have it work. Yeah, we don't, we don't want to get too fancy. Because then the thing will be like, oh, this is not valid. And it'll be like, oh. Okay. What do we need? Yeah, but... Like... My sense of symmetry is, is already... Out of whack. Like it's got to have a double door, or just no door at all. <laughs> Actually, no, I can't have a I can't have no door at all. Otherwise, it's not a valid building. Yeah. So it's got to have it's got to have a double door. This game better support double doors, or I'm gonna rage quit. <sighs> well, we better start uh, learning the game for ourselves without a nominee. Hey, I don't know the game. So at we all. don't have any. Stone left for more mortared stone. Really? All that stone we dug? Holy, we've got coal to spare. Yeah, we go through it really fast. Oh, there's a bunch of stone back here. God dang it. We really need... We need applied energistics. Yeah. Wouldn't an angel ring be nice as well? That's a mechanism. Okay, I can't stand on the stockpile. That's right. Well, you can, but uh, you you do risk getting stuck. But you can't oh. stand on the stockpile and build. Period. There is a massive pile of stone behind the base. I, I just like yeah. It's like, like yeah. There's a range. ton of stone back here. It's out of and range for all crafting though, so I don't yes. know why people are putting it back there. We need to move. We need to like take this dirt and move it like somewhere. I don't know out or something. Put it on the ground or something like that. I can. I can work on that. This is, oh, this is all ore. No, no, behind that. Behind that downstairs, there's a giant thing that was like half full of stone. Oh. Damn. Yeah, I'm currently relocating all of that stone. So I don't know if someone like was relocating the stone from where it was being used to craft to somewhere else. I don't know. Um, but we're out of pitch again. No, I made quite a lot. There should be lots of it. Oh, maybe it's just not in the thing that my machine, my thing wants it to be in. That yeah. is also annoying, the fact that the inventories are not synced. Yeah, one person should sync them and that's it. There is, because there is uh, 24 uh, pitch in this one that also queued and they're waiting to be collected because they didn't have any place to put it. Alright, we have lots of stone in there now, so. Queue up another hundred mortar stone. I wouldn't bother using the cart for that stone, that's literally one trip left. No, I'm transferring the, um, dirt out here. Okay. If I could figure out why this can't find that stockpile. Oh. There. No more stone. Or no more dirt.
Are we gradually cutting this out for the ramp? Oh, someone started on that. I don't know if they were going to continue. I think I started that was on that. Awesome. He's AFK. Uh, did we get the sawmill made? Oh no, we must still be waiting on something. Oh, it's ready to collect. Okay. Is Coffee still here or did he take off? He went off. No, he had to take off. Oh. Because guess who uh, started the crafting of it? He Coffee. did. Yeah, and no one can collect it or cancel it. Where is it? <laughs> it's in this uh, anvil on the end here. Hey, what is this? So Coffee started the craft, so he's the only Copper? one who can pick it up. Because he didn't put an output on it. Looks like gold. Oh, that, no, no, yeah, that, that is gold. Nice. No, we're, yes. we're probably going to need gold at some point. Why would he do that? He probably forgot about it. It's a very easy thing to forget about. Yeah, it's not a normal thing to have. Alright, I'll To have as a rule. Three minutes. It's a very bizarre rule. <laughs> Everybody yeah. has access to the house. Everybody has rights. And yet, the crafting machines are... Like, nope, you can't do that. Are you kidding? Yeah, they're restricted to whoever made the thing in the first place. I can kind of, sort of, see why it might have been done that way, so that you can have, like, a shared machine, but then, like, only the person who made it can come and pick it up. But, like, when you're actually trying to play cooperatively, that's really, really annoying. This right here is this just a dirt ramp, right? Think so. See, we can bury it and we can bury this stuff in rocks to neutralize it. But you have to bury it in rock. Slag. Slags do. Yeah, um, we we can put it in the mine shaft once we're. Uh... You know, so at some point we can like start putting stockpiles in the mine and do it that way. Um, sand is missing. How is this missing? Hmm? Oh, I probably didn't put it onto an appropriate stockpile. Yeah, it's not seeing any stone. It's seeing stone, but it's not seeing any stone. Yeah, no, it's because it's the whole per, per character bullshit again. Right, because I need to go into storage wow. and then turn on a thing that has stone in it. Which is probably not that one. Yeah, okay. now it's going. We do have plenty of pitch though, so it's not a, not a big deal. Uh, 
No, Asa's back. Hey, Asa, can you come grab the dirt ramp and put one down? Sure, hang on. Alright, sawmill is done. Uh, what do we want upstairs? Um, yeah, I guess so. Although, oh, it, it looks sweet. I must say, it looks pretty freaking sweet. I found some gold in your little tunnel. Wait, what happened to all the stone? <laughs> I think it just got converted to something. Yep. Alright. We have boards that we can saw, and signs, and a bed with an icon of a barrel. Uh, so that's weird. Shelf cabinet. Must be contained within a room. Oh my god, the room requirements are obscene. Ooh, there is a bookshelf. Oh, nice. Uh, but we need paper and lumber. So, lumber. I don't think I can... I don't even know if that matches up. I'm gonna place it and see. Like the little pieces of brick that are in here. Ah, that doesn't match up. Why doesn't that match up? You can't place there. Blocked. Why is it blocked? Sorry about that, I had to go AFK again. Why is it blocked where I need to place this? Because you probably haven't cleared enough. There's a stone just here. Uh, no, that should be fine. What are you trying to place? Another ramp. Oh, uh, it, ne it probably needs something under it to sit on. So oh, like, you okay. just can't place it in the sky. Oh. It has to actually have a base underneath it. It might need clearance above it, too. That's also true. Wow, that ramp is... Might want to do a switchback, eventually. How'd you get your mining up that fast? No, it's rocking the pink outfit, too. Yep. Hey, that's what the RNG gave me. I was like, who am I to, who am I to argue with random generated uh, destiny? Yeah, random generated penguins. So I think what you'll need is like you'll have to place it from oh. the top. Yeah. And it's gonna have to be like I think it from memory it needed like I think it was four long or something like that, so you need to build up from like here. Oh. What why is this derping out? It's like totally one off of where it needs to be. Oops. God damn it. That glitchy block, there's a glitchy block somewhere and... So like with that there, you might be able to build it. And it will have to be built from up here.
It won't let me build it from up here. Those, oh, wait. those stacks of stone are not load bearing. Come on, grab that. There we go. Fall! Why won't you fall? Does anybody else see that rock that's up there? Yep. Yeah, you have to get up high enough to be able to break it. Which rock? This one? There we go. Got it. Alright, we are n we've nearly closed the roof. I think Z, you've probably got the last load there to close it up, right? Yeah, probably. We got eight, but. Yep. Do we need to close in the windows, too? Oh, whoever put that new cart down again, you need to open up the deed for it and allow other people to use it. Alright, one sec. Blocks, but I can't pick anything up. You need me to pick something up? Ah, uh, the stairs. You can go. This Call place is still hole. blocked. Make sure it's trying to orient it right. Trying to orient it sideways. Q. Well, no, how do I get that window back that tells me? No, it was oriented, right? But I just. It says it's, this place is blocked. Still. How do I get that window back that tells me all the stuffs? Try to place it? No. The. The. You know, when it comes up with stuff, there was a window. I don't know why that disappeared. Comes up with stuff. Everybody's actions. Oh. See? Oh, thank you. Does there need to be stuff all the way underneath it? Where do we build the dirt ramps? Well, that's where we're trying to do. Thing upstairs for it. Okay. Well, we have enough dirt ramps. Oh. No, I'm building one for another location. Well, you can have these. I don't know if we can do it here. How do you know if it is a valid room or not? Any... It doesn't have any windows or anything other than a door. Do you guys have upgraded backpacks? Okay. The door is double wide. Well, I don't think it can be. Yeah, I've got a bear pack. Alright. All it does is increase the weight of what you can carry. So, a door? Uh, yep, a door. I don't think there's a stone door. <laughs> I found a hole. I 
Has anybody ever dug through the planet? Like. <laughs> I'm guessing that, uh, much like Minecraft, there's probably a, uh, Limit. a bedrock-style bottom. Yeah, I don't know how they do a spherical, a spherical voxel world. I have no idea how they do that mathematically. Uh, there's a few different ways, um, because I've looked into doing it myself. Um, but for the most part, it's faked. So there's a there's a few different ways you can do it around. Uh, you you can unpack a cube as a sphere, basically. So you you're what you're actually dealing with is actually a cube, um, but then you do a little bit of magic to have it all line up properly. And that's probably what they've done here. Um, and if you actually find the corners of the cube, it will look really weird, um, unless they do some additional trickery, but. Yeah, it, as long as they don't allow too much to be rendered, uh, you can pretty much hide the distortion that comes from it. What, what do you need help with, Diego? I'm just building a ramp to here, with the, so I can. Why do you build it over here? here? This is where the. Uh, oh, there's a stockpile in there with iron, isn't there? Yep. Individual shovel pulls. That's as many as my guy will let me do. <laughs> yeah, it's just like. Oh, uh, coffee's gone, isn't he? Yep. Yep. Ah, uh, there's two other things that he started, two research books that we're not going to be able to use. Those should automatically go into a chest. Only if he set it up personally. Although the, all the rest of them have been going into a chest. Uh, I'm going to need you to move. Well, let's hope that he actually set it up Thank that way. You. Let's just make sure the chest that they've all been going into has some space in it. Um, because it's full of books and apparently two torches. How do you create a dirt road? Uh, a road upstairs. Tool. There's a machine okay. up here called the Wainwright table where you can t make a dirt ramp. Oh, sorry, the, uh, no, the, uh... Road. The Dirt road itself, road. you need the road tool. Um, which I have at the moment. Alright. Let me, uh, repair it for you. Why is that on? Because it has no fuel. I just put two torches in it! I have no idea, then. Status. Turned off. Okay, how does one turn it on? Oh, there's a little... Shift, control, alt. Alright, the road tool is in the um, repair table upstairs, but it needs some stone to fix, and for some reason it couldn't see the thingy downstairs, so. Alright, just picked up the stone, so I should be able to hit the repair button on it now. Fueled, turned off. Thanks. What? How does one turn it on? Like, I see the red light blinking. The torch that's sitting right outside the door. Like, it's... <sighs> this game has a lot of weird quirks to it that are just like, what is it doing? I think it needs to be night to turn on, maybe, and it's not according to the server. Please! Do any of you have a sickle? Yes. What do you need a sickle for? <laughs> <laughs> to clear some brush off the road. How about we use dirt rather than stone for that uh, under the ramp? Although I think you don't even need that there now that it's done. Wait, why did you build over here? Or dig over here? 
Because I wanted it wider. Have you tried maneuvering that thing around? Yeah. Trust so, me, when you right. hit when you hit an edge with that thing, it will fling you about fifty blocks. I literally flinged on the other side of our little brick building here with that thing. <laughs> Gonna want a little bit of space. Maneuver. There you go. Did you fill it up with something? No, I just moving it so you could use it. You were the one building this. I'm just helping you. I'm putting away the slopes. <laughs> Well, when you're done with that, go grab some iron. <laughs> uh, did someone make a door for the... Uh, um... nope. Oh, nope. I thought okay. that's what Z was doing. Uh, well, there's wait. no carpentry table here. Uh, uh yeah. It's, uh, so. it's over here by the fishing thing. It's just hidden. Uh, hidden? Yeah, it's half inside the fishing thing. Oh, right, okay. Yeah. yeah, this thing here. Yeah, I can't make that door anymore at the moment. Uh, I think I can. Door. I haven't really learned that many skills. Alright, there's three doors ordered up. They're five minute crafts, so. Woo! Each. Yeah. Alright. Yoza. Oh wow, that's a that's a craft and a half. Wow. Uh, yay. Baking. I already have that one. There we go. I've moved the dirt. Where do we wait? We want iron ingots or iron ore. What do we want? We need to make sure that is a enclosed room first, or a valid building. Yeah, maybe we should make a building specifically for that um, machine. Because I'm thinking, oh. like, trying to add a room onto this existing one, like, it's already getting pretty awkward. What machine are you talking about? The sawmill. Oh, it's. I put it up on the top. Yeah, but it, it, it's not in an operational room yet, right? But ch double check it. Where it was there. Um. Oh, actually, no, it's happy. Yeah, the house itself is kind of upset, but the machine, I think, is happy. <laughs> yeah. I'm not getting any XP bonuses for my house. I've only got 81,000 skill points, so, you know, things. Oh, Eighty-one thousand. Can, uh, can we relocate the sawmill uh, so it's in range of the wood silo, which probably means putting it over where this kiln is. The wood silo. Wood depot. Stockpile. You got a crap ton of wood just right outside the base. Like what? Yeah, but it's not in range of the stockpile. It's <sighs> something what they really need to work. Like, that's just silly, like, uh, alright, so if we move this repair table, put it where the repair table was. Uh, can I move it? Probably not. Nope. What? The sawmill? Oh, I can pick it up. Never mind. There you go. He's now is this in range? Yes. Why are there wood planks yes. or yeah, boards right. in the cart? Remember to look at your storages. Why do we have four boards in the cart? I don't know. I didn't even think we could make them yet.
Oops, sorry. <laughs> they really need a search feature. Oh, Let's see. So you can search through all of your inventories for a certain item. It's not J.E. This is not a A.E. Ooh, I actually like the way that looks. It's kind of cool. Paper milling. Five more mortar stone for paper milling. So, can I get those crafted up? I need some iron to fix my pickaxe. There's a piece of iron in the cart. Can somebody look at the masonry table and see where it's offloading to? There's two projects in that that are just stuck. Uh, one of them can't offload. offload. Yeah. See? That's the one started by a nominate, I think. Well, I think that's one started by a nominate, which is done. It just needs to be sold. Yeah, it needs to be offloaded. So wherever a nominate is, if we can... The repair table? The, other what? the repair table, I don't remember what It's upstairs, mean. I think. Oh, yeah, that's right. Well, I have the pitch storage just mapped. It just, uh, oh, that was done about, oh, sorry. This one, why can't that output? We can, uh, rename these chests. Rename. Yeah, you, you just, can. I think you just have to console it. I think it's done, but um, just need console it. For some reason it's chased. There. Book chest is named. Alright, it's cancelled. Yeah, so I've just named one for the sawmill, so the sawmill's got an in-out. Oh. There's a... Uh... Oh. This is obviously the pitch chest. Pitch chest. Oh, we need paper for that. Um... Yeah, that's what I'm working on. I need to get the masonry stuff so I can make the the next book, which is paper milling. I've got it queued. Paper milling skill book. We was and someone it, was working towards the kitchen, but we didn't actually get it yet, did we? Well, yeah, that was all coffee. Um, paper milling yeah. skill book is the kitchen. We need four ingots still. I need six mortared stone. Where did that go? That should there should still be some left, I would imagine. Uh, no, there isn't. We might have to make some more. What are you talking about? There was just a hundred of it in here. No, there wasn't actually in there. It was outputting into the um, thingamabob. It wasn't actually available. It was already used. The thingamabob. Yay! Do we? Yeah, the what? The the watchamabob. The Duvalaki. <laughs> the storage thing? Okay, I'm making six mortar stone. Don't we steal it? Please. Alright, I'm gonna make four iron ingots to make the kitchen. Actually, I think those were already made now I think about it. Why is it not seeing the oh, ordered stone? I was gonna craft up four ingots for you, nominate. Is something grabbing the mortared stone from somewhere? There's one in here. Yeah, it just it just crafted a bunch. Pitch project. I'm gonna cancel that. No, nope, why'd you go Z? Oh, it's cosmos. I was lagging like crazy. My frame rate were dropping. Okay. Oh, 
much better. Stayed pretty stable. I did freeze once, so that probably helped. So it sees one. I made six, and yet it only sees one. So what happened to the five others? Did somebody start a craft that uses mortared stone? No hey. idea. Hey, Wallflower, at the end mm -hmm. of this this uh, little section here, this next ramp, I'm going to actually uh, turn it to the left so we can go down. Oh, okay. I was just getting more gold. Yeah, yeah, that works. There we go, finally. I just wanted to make sure you knew. Okay, to the left, got it. Uh oh, we gotta just wait 20 more minutes for this thing to stop. Advanced a... smelting skill book. Uh, uh. This is a pretty big gold vein. Mm hmm. Oh, sorry. Let's see, is cooking something over here. Oh, I'm just waiting for a door. I think one should be done, but I can't find it. Oh, it's. It would have gone into one of the outputs somewhere. It. Find it in oh, any hey, of I found the cement skill book. Let me go and relocate that. I might need to rename another chest to a book. Don't put it in the book skills. We need that for the spot for what the book is crafting right now. Because that's the only chest I think Coffee had checked on that. Alright, I'll put it in the one next to it then that's got a bunch of other junk in it. Uh, I'm going to put it in one that doesn't have anything in it and rename that one. Book chest two. Hmm. How original! And get myself one of these. Top that and go. So cement. Uh, I'm guessing. How do I rename the stockpile up here? Cement. Ah. Cement production efficiency. So it claims that paper milling is done on my UI? Or it must it's, be it's, close. It's very... yeah, it's not done. Again, oh, there are things. two... two things. There's a green and a yellow progress bar. The green means it's got all the it's got all the ingredients it has. The yellow one is actually the crafting. So if you yeah, see the green one that's full, that just means that yeah, the materials are there. Yeah, I didn't expect that to be the same on the on this other UI. It's all good. Yep. That was the it It tricked me once or twice too. So, I wonder, what do we need to make cement? What do we need cement for, is the bigger question. Well, it's a higher right. tier of construction material. Right. So, we don't need it yet, but getting our base made partly out of it will allow us to place the higher tier machines. Oh, well, not place, but allow, the, allow us to use them. That is a giant amount of gold. And it looks like asphalt requires concrete. So if we wanted to do faster roads, we'd need those. Uh, so if we took the stone out from under those ramps, would they fall? I don't think they do. I don't think any of the placed blocks have physics on them. That's a lot of stone. It is. Yeah. I, I'd rather you use dirt than stone because we couldn't, we've got like stockpiles full of dirt. Not really. Alright, I'll switch. But yeah, I don't think... have any dirt in stockpile. Uh, yes, we so do. I don't think the dirt... Well, let's just try. Let's just try on this last round, since there's only one dirt. I'm gonna take out all the stone from underneath it. And see if it falls. But I'm pretty sure they don't have physics on it. Hmm. I'm just ferrying resources around. Suppose this way we can have a walkway underneath it too. Yeah. 
And if it does need something under it, we can just put a little bit of mortared stone. Because, like, it's four stone to put one to, for one full block. Or one mortared stone, which only takes one stone. So, like, yeah, it's four, it's four times more efficient to put down mortared stone. Alright, I can grab that stuff then. Or uh, do we have it uh, up here? But, we uh, um, I mean, we've just about removed everything from below this ramp and nothing's happened, so I think we can actually just not have anything under it. But yeah, you can place uh, either lumber or... Uh, you can just place the wooden blocks underneath it. Because those are really quick to craft and we have a lot of wood. But and but, but they, they don't need support from all the way from the ground. So you can use them as placement blocks as opposed to having to completely fill everything underneath it. We need a stronger cart. Well, there's two carts around. There's the, the small one that were made originally, and there's one that's bigger than that. Well, there's the powered one, but we don't have access to any of that tech yet. Yeah, that's a while off still. Oh, somebody's already making a kitchen? Oh, good. I was yep. just about to make one. I was like, wait, this thing's actually crafting one. Yep. I started it up a few minutes ago, so yeah, it's, it's a it's a fairly long craft, and I think it has some cart. requirements that we probably aren't going to meet straight off the bat. Yeah. I will be right back. Is it a uh, hewn log that we're gonna want? Yeah, hewn log uh, you can use to just place anywhere. All right. Do we have a stockpile of it anywhere? Uh, there's some around. I think there was like five stacks of it. I think it's this one. No, not this one. Yeah, the one behind the building. There's like, yeah, there's a lot of it here actually. Gotcha. But yeah, you can just use the hammer to place that down. And yeah, you can place quite a lot of it. Okay, Very easily. It's like one tree is like multiple stacks of uh, wood now with all of their skills leveled up, so. And actually even this dirt isn't falling. So I think dirt, I think the, um, the physics only kicks in when you place the blocks down initially. Makes sense. We have the smaller cart, and then where's the larger cart? Um, unless well, the larger cart is fifteen hundred me, fifteen hundred kilograms. So you can look at the cart to see how much it holds. Not tell you which cart it is. I've been using the smaller cart. Yeah, and I'm guessing it's still over where Buggy <laughs> left it because he didn't bother finding the. Uh, I thought. I thinking... thought you were gonna do it. No, I, I just told you that I didn't have it. Yeah, it's over here. I assumed that you were going to go and do it. Yeah, it's over here. We only need uh, two need the... tiles. You oh, need oops. It. I'm going to need the deed. <laughs> oh, man. That's the sentence I was trying to get out. My brain was just like, oh, oh. I'm going to seize your twitch. My brain was just like, no. There's the small cart. There's the wooden cart. Cement kiln requires oh a piston, a gearbox, and a bunch of iron. Cause you know a cement kiln needs a piston for reasons. Ooh, a ceiling candle. I kind of like the sound of that. Ow, my head. <laughs> he was gonna say, whoops. 
blast oh. furnace. Is that going to be enough room to turn around in? Mint? I have no idea. I've never driven a cart before. Treasury? Wow. We can always dig it around uh, another set of tiles. Yeah. Wow, a machine shop. Wow. That is not a cheap craft. <laughs> 40 ingots. <laughs> Yowza! Ooh, I steal a hoe. Okay, y'all guys have access to the, uh, big wooden cart again. And I will be right back, because I can't get rid of the mouse cursor in the middle of my screen. Tab? No, even with it, without tab. Like, I can move, rotate my camera, I just will not get rid of the mouse cursor. Hit escape, unplug your mouse, and replug it back in. That's far more work than restarting. And do again. five jumping jacks. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm waiting for the mouse to boot back up, sure. Mm -hmm. You know, because that's how computers work. Ooh, are we doing a switch back? Nope, didn't get rid of that, even with the unplug and replug. Did you do the jumping jacks? Did you hit escape <laughs> first? I bet you, you did not do the jumping <laughs> jacks. You said, you know, that is a ridiculous thing, and I bet you if you would have done them, it would have worked. Nah, I'm just going to go for a full restart of the program. <laughs> program. Yeah, that's, that's far less work. That's what I would do. Than the jumping jacks? Yeah. How <laughs> <laughs> is that less work than... <laughs> They're not that hard. Well, but, for one, you don't even have work. to stand up. They're a lot of work, though. Not really. Uh, Restarting the computer, you don't even have to stand up. Exactly. I mean, starting the game, you don't even have to stand up, so that's, that makes it less hard right there. Yay, I got rid of my mouse cursor from the middle of my screen. I have too much stone. Uh, put some of it in the cart. Not not the cart that I'm currently working with. I don't know which one you're currently working with. The one you're standing by? Yes. Okay. Yes. Yes. Excellent. Yes. Yes, mister. Nope. <laughs> Yay, this can hold double the last one. And I'm still the pack dude. Yay. Man, well, well, what's the ratio of uh, iron ore to iron bar uh, without being all upgraded? Two to one. Well, without being upgraded, I don't, I don't know, but I know it takes two to one where it is now. Uh, no, it's one to one right now. Is it? Yep. Oh, okay. Because the thing says basic smelting efficiency 5 decreases iron ore cost by 80%, which is the max level. Um, which is weird, because... Oh, it probably means that there's, that like, a, if you make 50, it might only take, like, I don't know, 35 ingots or something like that, or 35 ore or something like that. Because I know that there are certain things where, yeah, your efficiency gets better than one to one, but you have to make more than one thing at a time. Hmm. Actually, gets worse. No, no, no. It's still fifty. Is still fifty. Oh, okay. Still fifty or. You like slid up that ramp. Us. <laughs> Sorry. You didn't walk at all. <laughs> Gold. Yeah, they're 
all one to one. Gold, iron, copper. Ooh, I need some food. Ooh, I'm gonna need some here soon, too. Oh, no. I still have pretty high levels of stomach contents, which is ridiculous. Like, why did why does it tell me what my stomach contents are? Yeah, that pie chart is pretty small, and it still says I have 1,500 calories. Hmm. Red lame the calories. A large, very unassuming building. Well, we've nearly filled up one of the stockpiles in that building. Yeah, I noticed the numbers going up as I was looking at the recipes. I've been pack mewing the iron ore from the house to the, the to the smeltery room. You gotta make you gotta make donkey noises while you did that. No. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. In yeah. fact, in fact, in fact, we can make that a law. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Everybody vote. <laughs> Quick. <laughs> well, I'm gonna go play some Overwatch now. <laughs> Party pooper. All right, let's see. On the wall cast. <laughs> I have this really advanced custom script where every time he pulls a cart, <laughs> it just, just makes animal noises automatically. <laughs> I wish. I'm not that good at programming. I bet you. I wonder. I. Uh, now, I don't know for sure, but it seems to me that this game also uses the Unity engine. That I could believe. Yeah. Uh, I can tell you in a moment. Are we going to have a stockpile specifically for coal for our smelting room, or are we just going to yes, share that? Yes, it is Unity. It is yep. Unity. That's what I thought. Uh, that was my hunch, was Unity. No, we don't want to... Uh, we don't want to just... Individual. The stockpiles in there are generally for the slag that's produced. Because I just filled up one of the uh, things with coal, iron ore, gold, and copper. Because coal is used as a fuel. It's not directly used. I'm guessing Ooh. coal will probably be used um, for steel when steel eventually arrives. All right, Z. Yep. So one of these holds uh, 12. Sad that we ended dark. I kind of like that series. Five. Um, so that would be 240. So 245 slag. One of these stockpiles holds. In chat. Raise your hand if you'd want us to want to see us do another arc series. Raise your hand. Yes, they have hands emote emotes. <laughs> uh, I want to show hands. No, 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 no emotes allowed. It's, you've got to actually raise your hand. We will see. <laughs> we will yeah. see through your webcam. Because <laughs> I, I kind of actually raised my hand. <laughs> <laughs> so two forty-five. Um, you get I two alone? a piece, so divide that by two, so it's basically like, it was like 12. I filled so the stockpiles as best as I can, but I had to go to overflow for another one. So, what, 120 crafts? All right. Yeah, 120 crafts of uh, iron or copper or whatever fill one of those things <laughs> you should have seen it I pushed the cart off the ramp and it still went up the ramp oh yeah I I was back here I grabbed some stuff behind it. I was coming around this corner uh, over by the wood 
and I clipped the edge of the stockpile, <laughs> and it flung me over the water <laughs> to where that where it was over there. It flung me like topsy turvy all the way over there. Nice. And I was like, "Wow, that was." All right, I just turned on uh, cooking <laughs> recipe for thirty iron ore. I figured we were uh, we're gonna we're gonna use it. So. Oh, do I need to bring back some iron book. ore? Oh mean... no! Why is there a campfire stew in the book chest? I don't know. Oh no! But I nommed it. Okay, good. Nom 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 nom. I have it. Well, what happened to the other? Book. There was another book that just finished crafting. That was like a thirty-minute craft. It was literally coffee. The last thing that he did. Was the advanced smelting book. Yeah, I see it. I got it. Can you put it in books? The book chest? That's why I left that gap open there. Whoa. Whoa! <laughs> it's Whoa. too fat. <laughs> it's too fat and I'm stuck now. That's yep, perfect. It's there. Okay, that's melting. Ah. Learn it. There we go. We're through. Can you make it down there? Uh, I'm, I'm gonna find out. But You're I probably won't be able to get back. There's no way to get back. <laughs> unless we dig around the stockpile. Yep. Okay. Yeah, um, I got most of the way down there. I just don't have a way to finish getting down there. Smith. Advanced smelting. Um... Is it this up here? Yes, that gave us alloy smelting casting, which is interesting. So that gives us a bunch of new things like gears and, and steel, steel working work. or charcoal. Okay, so that'll be you can get coal from wood, I'm guessing. Oh, modern axe. So we get a bunch of new tools now that we got steel working. Oh, we need a we need a blast furnace. Yeah, once we actually make it, <laughs> there's a few steps involved. This is as far as you get to go today, cart. Oh. Oh. Light. Camera. Action? I, I love it when people pass me in their in their uh, their static T pose. <laughs> Isn't <laughs> their T pose to you? Yeah, a lot of times, if somebody's like in between animations, like if they just jump, they'll whiz by me, and they're just yes. the static. The static body whizzing by me is like, oh. Uh, I got the card out. Alright. Well, we have ourselves. Like Tis decided. We have firehouse subs for lunch. Too hungry. It's getting ordered. I am really hungry. Because I haven't eaten a big meal in... What the heck time is it? Oh, a while. Mm -hmm. I need a big breakfast at about midnight tonight. This morning. That was about it. Oh, 17 hours. Give or take. I think the kit isn't the kitchen done in the sawmill? It is. Where be? Oh, there's the kitchen. All right. What is this thing gonna look like? Alrighty. I'm gonna go right next to the mill for reasons. Right there. Ding. All right. Crimson salad. Ah.
Ah, there's the huckleberry extra. Oh, wow. 50 huckleberries a piece. 50? Wow. Yep. For the extract. Five zero. Yes. Wow. Viddy. Viddy. Ah, ah, no, I don't want to walk back down the steps. That would be some expensive fertilizer. Wow. Um, uh, infused oil. Well, that's starting to sound like actually additions. Ooh, oil infused with flavor to enhance it. Oh, I have to add five. I have to add six dollars to get free delivery. All right, fine. Ooh, like double the price of a sub. Tortilla, wild mix, nice. Um, what do we use wood pulp oh, for? Four. Okay, that's two hundred huckleberry and a four basic salads just for a wild mix. It's only eight hundred calories. Really? Oh my god, we have so many claim pegs at this point, like... I, I kind of feel like we could claim, like, nearly the entire planet. Yeah, I have 25 more in my... I have 36. We have over 100 sitting in one of the chests here. That's... 30... There's 30... Well, yeah, we could, get a, we could get a good amount of space, but that's not even close to how big the planet is. Because the claim is what, about... Nine by nine it squares. Feels big. It, it feels like a lot of claim pegs, okay? Okay, <laughs> <laughs> buggy! So, what you're saying? What you're saying? <laughs> so, yeah, I guess the. Uh... How long until we have enough stuff for a, s a steel pickaxe? Or a steel axe? <laughs> Diego's already looking at, oh like, God. heck, like, three <laughs> levels beyond. Where we have any possibility of doing it, and it's like, nah. but, I, but I want, I want the oh. best stuff. I want all the things. <laughs> you the missed. You, you missed all of the work to get to this I point. I know. I would have <laughs> loved to have played that, but I, I went away. Look at that! I can actually pick up a couple of the beats that I planted. Oh, you know what? If we made twenty iron ingots, we could get. Oh, we need mechanics first. We don't have apparently. Uh, so we need four copper, four iron, and a water wheel. I can make the water wheel. B. One water wheel ordered, and we need copper and iron. So why don't I go and start that, and then we can get that research going. There. Give a little space with the beans. At least the grass hasn't completely... I would love to know why the grass disappeared. I mean, is it, is it just based on, like, area... I'm pretty sure it's know, just player activity. Cause we, I know this, this is... area we haven't been walking on this block nearly at all. Yeah, but I think it's like an activity radius type thing. Right. That's what it... It really has to be that. Like, that's the only reason why this would be spreading this way. What's up, ocean? Ooh. Really? I can't swim? I can't swim down? Mm -mm. Oh. Uh, yeah, you can. You can? Ooh. Uh, yeah, there is a way of swimming down. Uh, Why is... Control. Yep. Yes. Why is that raw fish? <laughs> the little purple, spiky, spiny things in the water. It's sea urchin. Yeah, but it's giving me raw fish. Yeah. Well, it's a game. Uh, yeah, I picked up the oysters and gave me raw fish too. Well, we have actually we actually have so much gold and very very little of anything else in comparison. Do we need any raw fish? Yes, yeah, so it would be useful for. Get us some of our vitamins. It almost seems like there's a uh, 
infinite water blocks sort of thing going on over here. I love how the water is clear when you look at it from the surface, but when you're actually in it, it's like... <laughs> it's like super murky. But yeah, you can see the bottom of it as long as you're up here. As soon as you go in it... Oh, yeah, there's... All right, raw fish time. Uh, ingredients. Okay, those ingredients are a little. Okay, plant fibers. We have enough plant fibers. We did have a bunch. I don't know we if have, we got much we left. Have... Oh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Almost eight stacks of plant fibers in this chest. Okay, we're all good then chest that I wanted to use to put the raw fish. <coughs> yeah, we do have a fair bit of raw stuff and not a lot of cooked stuff. I'm working on it, I'm working on it. We have a campfire roast, fried tomatoes. I need to find... Where did you put the raw fish? I've got it on me. I'm trying to find a chest for it. There's one right here. Uh, coffee ah. storage chest. There's a rubbish. Cause this is this is supposed to be the cooked. Everything is cooked and ready to eat from this chest. There's some charred fish. Oh, there's got to be better. There's got to be better recipes. Oh, at eight calories, five fifty. Okay, what is? Is this still a door over here? Oh no, the water wheel. Ooh, water wheel's got a minute left. Yeah, and I've got the four of each ingot now. Are you making the blast furnace? Or something? Uh, no, no, there was. Uh, it was a uh, research. That needed four of each ink, four copper and four oh, iron ink, right. plus a water wheel. What was that? Charred fish gives you two, and it's the same stats. Water wheel, water wheel. There it is. Mechanics. Mechanics skill buff. Uh, paper milling is almost done. The baking scroll is done. The what? The baking scroll out of the sawmill. Baking scroll out of the sawmill. I have that did a, that did a scroll? Yeah. It did a scroll on baking. <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure it didn't. Somebody had to uh, put that there's, in there. There's no scrolls in, in there. It's... Are you looking at the sawmill, like, chest? Yeah, sawmill, storage, in and out. Oh. Yeah, that's... That's not the chest that that goes in. It's not the chest you were looking for. Yeah, they really, really need to do something about the storage. I'm gonna put it in the book chest, too. I'm trying to name them, so I think people are not in the habit of reading the names. The chests. The chests. Well, I think most people have probably had it set up for a while to auto output into or auto input from a bunch of places. And a lot of That's them just brand auto output. New. True, but the, the sawmill doesn't actually produce those scrolls. So somebody had to make an extra one and then put it in that chest, the sawmill in and out chest. <clears throat> okay, so I've got these things. What was that? Right, 30 that thing. seconds. Mechanics is now queued up. Oh yeah. Look at that. Mechanics. 
might actually be able to make that motorized doohickey. Hmm, maybe. What would it use as fuel, though? Yeah, well. Well, let's see. You probably need oil and turn into gasoline and stuff before you can do that. Okay, paper milling. First. First! Okay. Now we can actually research or build or something. Something required paper. I can't remember what it was, but something required paper. Yeah, the bookshelf, amongst other things. Yeah, the bookshelf. And the question is, what do you make the paper in? Paper stuff in. Oh, that was that paper. It? That was that paper. It's, there's a paper mill, or something. And yeah, this machine. is <laughs> this is this is you know when when coffee was like, oh, it's this is complex. I was like, no, it's not complex. <laughs> this is a very simple one to one ratio between um, uh, skill point and table. <laughs> yeah, it's like okay, well, you want paper? Well, there's a paper mill. You want this? There's that. It's like yeah, there's no. There's no mystery to it. Oh, oh hang right. on. No, 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 no. We, actually, we could already make paper. Uh, it just requires two wood pulp. In the in the carpentry table. Carpentry table? Yeah, unless, the, unless this is like an additional thing that you can do on top of that. Paper milling. Um, well, I've now... Hang on. Can I forget these, maybe? I need another windmill. Do we not have a place to store wood pulp? I don't know. Uh, right, so we needed... I think it was just an unlock we had to do. Like, we had to get paper milling before we could actually do the oh, recipe. Yeah. Um, as far as wood pulp, uh, put it in the chest next to the lumber mill upstairs. Um, so I need 20 paper. Uh, I'll, I'll craft 20 paper up. 20 paper is on its way. Three seconds apiece. It's all a minute. Uh, where is it outputting to, though? <laughs> uh, I didn't set up, well, wherever it's set up. Um, let me go check. Storage. It is outputting to book chest. Okay, that's fine. I can grab it from that screen. Yeah. Once it's out of there, I'm going to want to take that away. I do not want it out putting into book chest. Yeah, let's start getting into the practice of putting a chest next to the machine and having that as it's in out. Okay, it's only 14. Yeah, I'll grab them and go make the bookcase as soon as it's done. And then hopefully we can put all the books in there and it will have a lot more storage for books. At least one can help. Is there a higher level cart? Yes, powered cart requires advanced things. Ah, okay. In fuel. Fish trap. Has anybody tried the fish trap yet? I think Flower was playing around with it at one point and couldn't work yeah, out how I to get it Yeah, I tried to put some, like, corn in there. I didn't know what else to put in there. Worms! <laughs> wormies! Do we have wormies? Oh, I have fish! How do I get fish out of there? Um... Where are you? Oh, there you are. I'm guessing... Open? Oh, there's corn in there. That's all I see in there. Yeah, that's all that's in there. The fish are a part of the... They weren't in there before, though. Oh. It was empty. 
All right, we have our bookshelf. I'm going to place it underneath the stairs. And hopefully... Oh, really? It's freaking decorative. What? Really? It's decorative. Bookshelf? Yep. Wow. It looks like a Minecraft developers. map. I just don't get the developers. Yeah, like, seriously, freaking make the bookshelf actually be able to take books. So you can put all of your books in there. Although I guess if you were playing this properly on a multiplayer, you would probably throw your uh, books into the store and sell them to other players. Yeah, farming, totally, totally pointless. Like, literally, like, pointless. With the, with the whole temperature and, like, nitty-gritty details. I mean, I'm getting some good supply of beans, but everything else, absolutely not going to grow here. Maybe be oh, beets are starting to disappear. I think because of... I planted, I know I planted at least three of them. <laughs> Just, just to be annoying, there's another tier of cooking. Yep. Sorry, no, 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 no. There, there is two, two more tiers of cooking. <laughs> there is advanced cooking, which we haven't done yet, and then after that, there is cutting edge cooking. Yep. <laughs> they really want you to be cooking in this game. Yeah. So. Of the things to mod, like the first things that I would say to mod is like, yeah, get rid of like, give an option to get rid of the requirements for crops so you can grow them anywhere. And uh, better storage options for sure. Yeah, it's absolutely painful. You'd need, you literally need farms all over the planet in order to meet those requirements and actually get a yield on your crops. Okay, I'm actually just going to shuffle this wood around because if we put it in the one where we originally had wood, it'll be in range of all of the tables. And then I'm going to get rid of this stockpile on the end so we stop using it. Wood shuffle. Yeah, just the, the ability to lock what can go into a stockpile would be really nice too. Because like we've got a specific stockpile for wood and a specific stockpile for stone, but then as soon as you as soon as you go and add them as a destination for certain things. Or sorry, as a source for certain things, you end up with wood going all over the place. So I think that ultimately can be summed up again in just better storage options. I hope the devs do a good modding API for this because that's like, you know, again, like in Fortress Craft, that's the biggest thing that lets that down is the fact that the API sucks. Yep. But I could easily see myself uh, spending several days playing this <laughs> with some some mods to make it a little bit better. Uh, I don't think that's empty yet, do you? And now you just... The only thing in it is oh. uh, wood pulp. This is quite a lot of wood, actually. We are not going through that very fast at all. We just gotta be careful because this is actually a stockpile. Oh. 
Oh, I think this stockpile's full. It is full. All right, well, put a little bit into the hewn log one, I guess. No, not the logs. No, I don't want the logs. Stop giving me the logs. That, that. You press E and drag. That's the that's the safe way to do it. Yeah. I wanted to be a rebel and not be so safe. Somebody, can somebody take the wood that's in here? I want to get rid of this stockpile that's down one. The uh, where? Back here. Grab the wood that's in here. Two storage chests over by the other side of the farm is for seeds. We are accumulating a lot of them. Why is there, Diego? Are you building a? Are you building a? Uh, a ramp? No. Then why are you leaving this cart over here? Oh, because I went to go. I meant to go grab the deed. Oh, just build a ramp. Just put a ramp like right in this little notch right here. Yeah, you need like one dirt to make a dirt ramp. It's super cheap. Here, I'll make that for right you. Here. Okay. for those beans to grow <laughs> and one plant died <laughs> hey Darren how's it going sorry if I don't respond right away I tend to uh, try to do more playing than anything hey. that or make fun of each other it's a toss up between which yeah Kind of silly that we got everything this accelerated, but like right now we're just waiting on technology. <laughs> yeah, the research. Yeah. I mean, normally I guess you're waiting around for skill points and stuff like that as well, but. Yeah, either way, it's a grind. I mean. Yeah. Skill points. That's that's a grind. That's a huge grind, depending on your settings. So I don't. I don't think because we've kind of maxed of out, yeah, we've maxed out all the mason stuff. We still got metal construction. Um, so what do we need to get the steel foundry thing of a bob up and running? Uh, that's a blast furnace, I think. Uh, I think that's over here. Probably in the anvil. Or not. Although, yeah, you can make steel tools in here, which needs steel, which is made in the blast van. Okay, um... Crafted at Annabelle, yeah, blast furnace. Do we have a yeah. stock? It's right at the top. Really? Two bricks, two iron. Oh. Okay, uh, well, we should have brick, and I'll go and grab two iron. In fact, uh, let me grab the two brick from here. I've got, I've got the two brick. Taking off that. 
Are you just gonna grab it? I'll start yeah, to I'm just, craft. I'm just gonna grab the iron now. Okay. I've got the bricks. Just grabbing the iron. <clears throat> Twelve minutes to craft the blast furnace. I'm That's guessing not bad. this thing is gonna be a lot of uh must be contained within a room. Thirty two yeah. tier two plus materials, forty five mm -hmm. cubic meter volume. That's not too bad. Um, depends on how big it is. We could probably fit it in the other, uh, like right at the end of the wall, when you go in the door of the, the stoner place, just oh, go all this? the way to the end of the hall. Hmm? Yeah, I'm going to have to cancel that and start it again, because, like, if I just press the button, it'll take the stuff from mine. Oh, you have to cancel. Can you just cancel that? Because if I just hit order on here, it will take the stuff I have on me. Whereas oh. if I, if you otherwise you have in. to, well, I have to know what storage you have it available. Uh, you have it set to pull from. I didn't. And then... I didn't have it any yeah. storage. Just because I didn't want it to just go somewhere and be like, okay, where did that go? That went somewhere. Um, the mortared stone might count. We might be able to put it inside our, um, our, uh, smelting junk thing. This, yeah. That's, this. Well, it, it needs a room. Count. Well, so, this is a room. Well, I'm it thinking, just happens yeah, forever. you go in, you go in the door, and you just walk all the way to the end of the little hallway. Depends on how big it is. I mean, if it's bigger than two by two or so, uh, there's really not much we can do other than take one of these things out of here, mm -hmm. or, you know, add on to the back of the room, which is not completely out of the question. But is tedious. there anything I can do to help? Uh, we're just sort of waiting for things, stuff. Probably go around and gather, you know, if we're low on plants to cook, like tomatoes, if we're low on those. Because uh, they do grow in the wild. Yeah, we're definitely low on tomatoes. Ish. Oh, here we go. So, unlike the bloomery, the blast furnace does not create tailings as a byproduct, but it does yeah, create yeah. air pollution. So we can take, we can take, basically one of those. Um, since it doesn't create tailings, we can take one of those uh, stockpiles out. Yep. Because it's not going to fill it. I agree. <clears throat> now I'm just trying to work out what it actually needs. So where did you see what it needs in terms of room? Uh, that's the question mark. I don't know what it needs. Oh, okay. Hang on. No, it does say here. So it must be contained within a room, 32 tier 2 and 45 more. Oh, okay. So what are tier 2 materials is the question. Well, I think that's the, the brick that we use in here. That's why it okay, had to be brick. So Okay, so building tier two is lumber, brick, and glass. Tier three is steel and concrete. Oof. So, okay, so we need to make it out of lumber, I would guess it'd be. Oh, we just made it out of mortared brick. It's already brick. That, that no. room over there. Which room? The, the big giant the... brick building right next to No, no, to that's, that's mortared stone, not brick. Brick is this orange colored, the, the orange br uh, brick shaped texture here, like right inside our main building. Oh, really? So we might be able to get, well, it depends on the requirements. We can try and put it upstairs and then replace some of the, well, you know, replace some of the building and see what it does. It might work. See, if not, um, we can just make some, we'll just, in fact, I'm going to pre-craft a bunch of lumber. 
um, just in case. Seems a little dangerous putting it in this wood, <laughs> wood house. Uh, yeah, sure, let's smelt up some steel in a wood house. <laughs> now, depending on the power requirements, we may need another windmill. Well, I don't say anything about power requirements. I think it's fueled. So, okay, so it's going to be coal. The only problem yes, I know. She group text messaged all of us. Have, oh, you're on that like, any of yes. the metal. <laughs> I muted it. Or the coal. All it was a group was text message, and I figured you'd place. respond. Yeah. <laughs> sure. Well, so it was like, that's yeah, why my instinct was putting it over here, because this... I'm ready to go at any time. Smelter right here. What we could do is this, this area outside where we have this smelter is swap that out with uh, lumber or uh, brick and okay. make this the area. So the area was what, 43 cubic meters? Uh, let me just double check. I think it was 45. Let me just double so, check. So, I mean, this would be big enough, depending on we make it four high, it should be big enough. Cause that's yeah, 45 one. cubic meters, so five one, by two, five. Three. It's basically three wide. Um, one, two, three, four, five. Three by five. So it's 15, 30, 45. So we needed three high. Would be would be the exact size that we would need. So we could do a four high and really make sure. Depending on the footprint of the thing, too. I mean, if it's ginormous. It's, um, I saw a screenshot of it. It looks decently big um it looks like it's maybe four high yeah it looks like it's two by two by four okay well it's good if we make it four high i would definitely have the volume for it um but we would need a bunch of brick or awesome. i guess lumber awesome uh, I think you got queued something on the butchery. Oh, there's missing a wolf. I've got a wolf in the chest here. Yeah, I think it's only missing one. Alright, I'm queuing up a bunch of brick, enough to make a 5x5 five five base. And then uh, I've got lumber crafting already, so we'll do the walls out of lumber. We'll you know see you how that works. Well, the base is done. Yeah, but it's it's out of um, stone, not brick. So if we, if we make oh. it out of brick instead, it'll be better. Like it'll give us closer to the the count of the things that we need. Right. So we're gonna. I need to move this chest that's here. So let me grab the ingots. Ooh. Only we'll carry fifteen apparently. They'd be heavy. Thanks, Z. Sorry about that. Oh, no problem. Oh, there it finishes. It's just new. I couldn't do anything with it. I tried to add the carcass, but I couldn't. Yeah, figuring out how to add the carcass was a bit of a pain. Uh, yeah. Chest is in my inventory, ready to be placed back down again. Alright, can you, um, if you've got room, can you pick up some of the stone so I can put brick down instead? Okay. I mean, my, my sweet, my sweet, sweet stone hammer coming at you. Oh, man. There's already... Oh. 
want to grab. So we want to grab the blast furnace or the what? What is this thing? Bloomery. No room in destination in... What? Oh, I have to... Really? Oh, I've got ten already. Okay. Well, I'm going to put them on the outside. That is a walkway. Uh, no, we don't want to... The wall no, is going to go here. All right, what? all right, all right, all right. Use your resources. You want it? I'm just making a walkway. It's gotta look pretty. <laughs> I'll just put the. What the? What was that? I'll just place that there for now, temporarily. Right. So we need two more bricks. Sorry. Yep, I got the bricks. Now, do we need the back wall here taken out too? Um, no, I don't think you need that. Probably not. Taken out. Like okay. we just need a certain uh, a number of things. It doesn't necessarily need to be all like uniform materials. Uh, uh, so now if I can... We had a little dirt. I could. Uh... I think it'll tell you how many blocks exactly you will need of the tier 2 material. It does, but uh, I'm just going to make it out of, you know, I'm not going to be precise. I'm just going to make a building out of that thing and hope we have enough to start with. You are right there, Oss? Got no, thanks. Seemed a little stuck. Oh, did someone pick up lumber or is that... Uh... I picked up lumber. It's in the cart. Oh, okay. Dirt back here. Oh, you can make a you can make an actual ramp out of stone or something instead. I'm just gonna move it all the way to the edge. <clears throat> we got the dirt sitting around. Yeah, we got dirt in the pile back there as well. So it needs to be bare minimum for high. We may as well take it up to the same height as the existing thing. I don't know if anybody caught this, but I started digging into the side of the hill that I was actually moving towards. <laughs> I was like, wait a second. This kind of defeats the purpose. There. There's a stockpile with dirt back there. Oh, I guess I just, uh, I, I like doing this off the hard way. <laughs> <laughs> One shovel full at a time. <laughs> yeah, you carry really? 10 of them. Is that right? <laughs> all right. There, now it's Funny. a proper Funny. Yeah, thing. That's it's proper. <laughs> this is a different <laughs> version. Right it was a high school humor version. Right there. Okay. Anti traces? Trying to put this in the middle. Don't want that there. Ugly. Oof. Oh, I was. I put that there so I could put it back here. Where do you want it? Oh, uh, right, right there? Right, right here. I was just shifting this over so it was centered. Because I know it'll All trigger right. and dominate. <laughs> there. Ooh, the upper looks all smooth. It does, doesn't it? Fancy. <laughs> oh, oh. 
There it is. It's even got a ladder on it. Nice. <laughs> There's your ladder. What has a ladder on it? It's a non-functional uh. ladder, but it has a ladder. Oh, you put the blast furnace in? Yeah. Oh, snap. I got the chest to go back in there. I'll bring, bring it forward a bit so we've got a bit more room. Wow. Uh, okay. So, I guess the chest can go here. Seems legit. Uh, <clears throat> I think we should do one more row of bricks, otherwise there's going to be no gap between the door and the... Um, well, you could have put it back one. Well, I did put it back one, but then you couldn't get around behind it. I guess that doesn't matter. Hey guys, I got more bricks. I don't think you need to go behind it. It's, uh, its status is not happy. Yeah, well, we need more lumber. Oh, we got a bunch more brick. Uh, I <laughs> guess we could do part of it out of brick since we have the resources. I like how it's zero meters cubed out of one million meters <laughs> cubed. Used by objects in the room. <laughs> <laughs> well, we know how big the world is. <laughs> <laughs> Here. Since we have way more brick than I expect us to have, we can finish it out of brick. Yeah, I queued up a bunch. It. I don't know how to describe this building. It's like a. Rivet, steel pipe, so steel uses iron. Brick, stone, and so. wood amalgamation. One to one ratio there. Oh, there's definitely. Oh yeah, there's definitely a savings. Um, 50 iron in this is only 40 ore. Nice. So it's it's a slightly better than uh, than one to one. It's like it's like uh, point. What is that? Point Five eight. Fourths. Yeah. Four fifths. Not sure. Two hundred. Yeah, eighty. Yeah, it's definitely eighty percent of what it was before. And charcoal uses lumber, not not raw wood. I think I was oh, of course, because you know. Got it. Because you know, wood is wood. Ooh, he's doing like terracotta roof. Nice. Yeah, it's the the brick roof. Thought it looked pretty nice, although it's a it's a derping out a bit on the corner here. But oh. yep. I guess actually, no, I know what we can do. We can not. Uh, well, hmm. Don't maybe. Be such a derp. Don't be such a derp. That is one heck of a marching cubes algorithm right there. I would not have liked to have written this algorithm. <laughs> that was awesome. He just jumps off and goes right down to the floor. In the one spot where you can fall through the roof into the floor. Why does that stuff There's always no happen to me down. and me alone? There's no staircase. A staircase? Jump! <laughs> All damage is in the thing in this game? Uh, not really. <laughs> <laughs> it is, but it doesn't do, much. it doesn't do that much. It takes away your oh, no, food, not anything else. A lot. <clears throat> Oh, might need a bit more brick if we're going to do uh, the whole thing out of it. <clears throat> yeah, it's not quite even either because the front here is one lower. You should have the wall a bit higher here, up here.
The who's the what's it? <laughs> so here, we have a wall. Right. Right block. Uh, I don't know why we would need a wall there. <clears throat> yeah, to get it level with the other wall. Or else it's gonna be oh, a Oh, I see what you mean. It. Otherwise, it's gonna not work <laughs> in terms of slope roofs. Yeah. Should we move the stockpile that's uh, next to the mine? <clears throat> that's kind of the mine stockpile, isn't it? Well, I figured uh, maybe just move it over a little bit so it's easier to get a cart down there. Uh, we've got this little area back here behind it. Yeah, it's just getting through there is sometimes a pain. I, I guess now that it's squared away, it's not so bad. Well, you just gotta use Diego, he's the expert pack wheel. <laughs> Uh, somehow I maxed out the other one over here, though. Oh, looks like somebody might have grabbed some. I figured out how to put the cart in reverse and back my way up this ramp when it wasn't finished quite yet. That was a fun time. Just go flat across the flat across the roof, trying to make it all look fancy. But aesthetics. Yeah, aesthetics are very important. I just fixed the way up. But you had to use there the same building material that you're actually trying to use. <laughs> yeah, but uh, it's not like we, we can get away with not making some more just by saving those four. This is shut down. Status out of fuel, right? Uh, out of fuel. I put 20 coal in there. Do we need no, more the kiln, iron? No. Uh, the kiln is out of fuel for making more bricks. Do we need what? More iron? I do and how did I get this stuck? Um, the main thing I think we need more of at the moment is coal. Because uh, it doesn't look like we have much left. I found a patch of that. Uh, storage. We have 20, 40, 60 coal over here. Okay. Well, that's that's plus right, the then. twenty I put in the thing already to to smell. So it's got eighty coal. Which I mean, we can always we can always use more. And if we have the cart down there, we might as well. We'd use more light sources down here. Where are those built? Well, there's various ones. There's hey, coffee, like I thought you had stone brazier, which I think is the mason table here. Um, I thought you had work to be at coffee, not not like coming in the stream. Stone is done. I'm not sure what that was for. Stone Brazier, yeah. So I'll do three more of these. There. <clears throat> I, I'm confused. So, oh, yeah, some more, some more crafting. How? 
What did I do? Okay, anybody who opens these, please, please, please uncheck the book chest. As your as your output, the only thing that should have that book chest or the book chest two um, is the research station. <clears throat> oh, nice mechanics is done. I just oh, there it, it is. Just saw you pop it. I just took the stuff, the food stuffs out. Right there. There's the campfire was dumping into the food chest or the book chest. So. Should we keep going with dirt ramps or should we upgrade to stone ones? No. Uh, Mostly kind of up to you. Sure, there's a super huge difference. I yeah, figured it's probably a difference, but maybe with the motorized one, there's a bigger difference. <sighs> All right, so what do we get out of there? We can make combustion engines, we can make lots of stuff actually. Copper wiring gear, piston servo. Combustion engines, combustion generators, gearboxes, machine shops. Well, that's clearly the machine we're going to make. So, what do we need to make a machine shop? We need four lumber, six boards, and eight metal ingots. There's a motorized excavator that we can use too. Oh, nice. Like a, like a bucket, um, bucket excavator. We need eight iron ingots. Where did the iron ingots end up? Are they up in the. Iron ingots I put in this chest temporarily next to the door. 24 iron and some copper. Yeah, I need the iron. Right on the right side of the door there. Only carry 15 at a time. Alright, how is this thing? Ooh, it's green. Status is good. Oh, no, not anymore. Yeah, uh, second. I, I'm just sorting the roof. Find out. Z broke it again. Okay, let's uh, it wasn't working. Yep, all is green. Alright, all machine is shop is going. So, that. Oh yeah, we need the storage. I want this to be ingot storage. Uh, so that means theoretically we can make steel now, right? Indeed. I'm working on stuff and things. <clears throat> ingot storage is checked. I got three and a half stacks of tomatoes. Ooh <laughs> aside from damage, I don't know if that well, I would imagine the steel pick must have some effect. Um how much damage it can take or it reduces the amount of uh nutrients you use and stuff. I don't know. And 
steel is just a product of iron, so I'm just going to smelt, like, all the iron that's in here. 125. Because pretty much... Yeah. So, I'm going to order all of that. Ooh, that's fast! Six seconds! You didn't even get all of the Six iron. Six seconds apiece. How about fuel? There's still more iron for you to use. Oh wow, that yeah, that's pretty good return. Copper. I wanna smell like half the copper. And like like a bunch of Wait, where's the stockpile with dirt? Reasons. You got an iron ingot for some reason. Where do you want it? <laughs> uh, oh, there's there a chest in here by the blast furnace that uh, that's where the iron is going to be going. So this thing is air pollution, right? Yeah. Yep. So this is going to be belching out the air pollution. Sorry, butterfly. I wanna go elsewhere. You know, I noticed there is no rain. I wonder if that's a feature that they're wanting to do. I uh, hope not. No idea. Hopefully. I don't like rain in any game. I would like to see it rain. What Asta's doing over here? He is spazzing out. <laughs> Am I? <laughs> you were just jumping and <laughs> you don't know what you were doing. That's yeah. weird. It uh, apparently putting dirt. Jumping much? Whoa! Somebody is continuing the dig. Yep. Uh, those stone braziers should be done. Yeah, I grabbed them. I'm gonna be setting them down. That's why right. I'm uh. Are we looking Digging. for iron, or what are we just, are we in general? Ooh, there's a huge vein of coal back here. Ooh. Like, huge vein of coal. Wait, pull this out. Yeah, Come on, Diego, that. you can do it. I don't know, I think I ended up actually stopping. Yeah, that's a huge, ginormous. <laughs> just watching your character struggle is freaking <laughs> hilarious. There's nothing I can, okay, there we go, I got it. Is mine still going, or is that somebody else? No, it's Diego. <laughs> there we go. I'm mostly just going for coal currently. Worthless bookshelf. That's what I'm gonna name that bookshelf. Uh, we are now industrialized. Super duper fast. Which uh, which one uh, which one of our supplies has uh, wood? For fuel. Wood is back here. There's a whole large stack of it back there. You might want to go to the other side. Or you can okay. parkour your way through. <sighs> yeah, a ton of wood. If you want it for fuel, you don't want the hewn wood, you want the right raw log. <laughs> Coffee said, "Don't jinx I think we're the out rain." Of that. I don't see any in here anyway. Uh, 